Hi, and welcome to Campus Mortgage. Today, we will be discussing part three of a three-part video series, which will cover review of the loan estimate. In the last part of the loan estimate review, we will take a look at a few frequently asked questions that were submitted to the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau by various lenders regarding the loan estimate. The first question, what do you do if you do not send the disclosure package including the loan estimate within three business days? Unfortunately, failure to provide the loan estimate to the borrower within three business days of receipt of application is a compliance violation. The lender asked, on loans that are secured by rental property and land only, are we required to disclose the escrow information even though we are not escrowing? Per the CFPB, assuming you are referring to the escrow disclosures on the loan estimate and the closing disclosure, there would be no requirement to disclose escrow information if you are not establishing an escrow account. If the contract states the seller is to pay for the owner's title policy, would that mean that it would not need to be disclosed on the loan estimate? The CFPB states that it still needs to be disclosed. It would need to appear as a seller credit under the Calculating Cash to Close section of the LE. If a loan is locked and then is extended, is a revised loan estimate required? A revised loan estimate would not be necessary unless there are charges to interest rate dependent charges. If a rate lock extension is being charged, then a revised loan estimate would be issued and the change circumstance would be documented in the loan file. If there are no changes to the loan estimate, do you still have to send a final revised loan estimate? The answer is no. If a loan estimate is initially issued with a locked interest rate and there is no change of circumstance prior to the delivery of the closing disclosure, the regulation does not require issuing a final reviewed loan estimate. And last but not least, please take a moment to read our disclaimer. As always, the information contained in this video is time sensitive and subject to change without notice. For more tips, videos, and for a full list of courses offered by Campus Mortgage, please visit our website at www.campusmortgage.org. Thank you and make it a great day.